Good morning, everybody. Uh, it's Mark with Eggers and Bacon, and just want to give everybody a little update of what's been going on around here. Um, it's been a super busy month. Uh, we go racing at the Bonneville Salt Flats twice a year. Uh, we run a 1968 Volkswagen Carmen Ghia. Had real good luck with the car. We've set nine class records with it so far, and it's been a lot of fun. Um, this year, we ended up buying a new van that we converted into a camper van. So we've been working on that the last couple weeks, trying to get it ready to go, uh, so we have something to tow the car and sleep in while we go racing. This is our new camper van. It's a 2006 Ford E250. It's a handicap van, but we're going to pull the handicap lift out of it. It is a high roof, so it's a full six and a half feet standing room inside. And this is what we are converting into our camper. Um, so we've been working on that. We've been working on some fencing. We've been working on the car, getting it ready to go. So it's just been a super busy month and we haven't been doing as many videos. So. Uh, here's a couple highlights from our month of August. We were able to start working on our privacy fencing in the front. Uh, this was the only access into the property was coming through the front yard and into the property. So now that we have the culvert in and access, we can finish up the privacy fencing here and put some of our stuff on the side here where it's a little less seen from the road. Uh, this three row fencing is all going to get taken down and we are doing five foot no climb fencing hopefully for some sheep and goats in the future also with going out of town we had to make sure everything else was automated uh, so we don't have sprinklers run in ground yet so we just have hoses run everywhere we use this hose and timers uh, we've got one hose that runs all the way out to the garden and does all of our garden drip. The other one runs down the tree line and hits all of the drip for all of the trees. Uh, this has been a lifesaver, just helps automate stuff so we can take off. Uh, for the chickens, uh, we can be gone a couple days. We use these five gallon buckets with uh, nipple waters on the bottom. And once they're full, they're good for at least three or four days. We do have a great person that used to watch our kids and she does pet sitting. She comes over and fills up the duck ponds every day and feeds and waters all of the birds for us while we are gone. So that is also a lifesaver knowing that we can leave the animals and somebody's there to take care of them. So. And then other than that, it's just been harvest season. I mean, we've been harvesting tons of zucchini. I always plant way too many zucchini, and I tell myself every year, plant less, but uh, lemon cucumbers, starting to get some tomatoes. Uh, our onions are doing amazing, giant onions. And then the plums are ready to pick. So that's about it for August. So that was August. Uh, we're into September now, starting to cool down a little bit. It's actually been a very mild summer for us anyways, but going into September, we have one more race, so we'll be gone for another week uh, at Bonneville, and then when we get back, it's going to be pairing up uh, birds and starting our breeding season. Uh, so we're breeding some naked neck Easter eggers, uh, olive eggers, uh, more call ducks hopefully this year. Uh, so it'll be getting into breeding season and just more harvesting in the garden. Hopefully we have some more time to do some work and stuff and uh, videos and have some more fun stuff going on. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. Thank you for watching and you guys have a great week.